It is 90.3 KEXP Seattle. We stream all over the world at KEXP.org. My name is Troy Nelson, and uh, this is going to be awesome. I'm so glad to have these guys here in Seattle and in our KEXP live room today. It is Peaking Lights. So Peaking Lights, if you are ready, have at it.
You're listening to Peaking Lights live here on 90.3 KEXP Seattle. And uh, so glad to have Peaking Lights in town tonight playing at Barboza. The new album is called Cosmic Logic. You can find both of those tracks that you just heard on there. That song called New Girls. And uh, can we introduce Peaking Lights, please? Hi, I'm Indra. I'm Aaron. Indra, that's a great name. Thanks. What does it have uh, the, some kind of background or meaning? Uh, yeah, actually, it's a Latvian name. My family's from Latvia. That's really My parents cool. were born there. Yeah. Wow. Indra. Yeah. That's awesome. And uh, husband and wife duo, traveling and touring and bringing your uh, children with. I think that is the coolest thing. Yeah, it's, 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 it's crazy. Mean, it's a little cra- crazy. <laughs> <laughs> we're crazy. It's pretty crazy, <laughs> but it's pretty awesome. I think that's pretty cute. I also, I play in a band with my wife, so I know oh, really? what it's like to yeah. uh, create music. Music, you know, with your significant other, so it's it's great. It has its challenges at times. I mean, yes. bringing the kids, but you know, we're it's all it's all part of the fun. How old are the kids? <laughs> One and a half and three and a half. One and a half. Oh wow. Yeah. Kids, 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 kids. I thought maybe <laughs> nap like time, eight kids. And 10. <laughs> no, no, nap time. Kids. I wish eight and ten. Yeah. I mean, that'll be those Get will be the golden days. Six thirty in the morning, kids. <laughs> oh, After no. we're up till three, right? right exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Show, Doing yeah. a rock show, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. So you have you guys played Seattle before? Yeah, uh, we have. Yeah, we've played Barboza before. Oh, very cool. Yeah, and where else have we played? We've played um, Joseph S. Uh, jo- S. Josephine. That was an awesome show. That was, yeah, that was um, a, that was a that was a uh, long time ago. Right, all several ages. Several years ago, six, maybe four years. years. No, longer than that. Yeah, it's been. Well, how long yeah. have you guys been doing this? Yeah, since time. 2000, late 2007. 2007. Early 2008. Yeah. And you uh, have put a couple of records out on your own, although this one is out on Weird World, which is a subsidiary of Domino, which is yeah. uh, Domino's yeah. such a great label. They have so many great artists. So that's a cool uh, place to be. Yeah, it's been yeah. great. Yeah, Amazing we... working with them. Yeah. Did yeah. you guys do a vinyl versions of this album? Yep, we did. A yeah, couple uh-huh. different vinyl versions. Uh, there's Well, there's one that's... Uh, that's just the record, and then there's one that has a couple of the like couple of remixes. Very cool. That we did ourselves of the. You re- remixed yourselves. Yeah, we remixed. That's ourselves. awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? <laughs> uh, that song, New Girls, uh, Indra, is that sort of an homage to some artists that have inspired you? Oh yeah, for sure. And who are some it's... of the people that you're calling out in that song? Uh, well, I I I just go through uh, different feminists, different musicians, mm-hmm. from Gloria Steinem to Yoko Ono and uh, Kim Gordon, and uh, I used to be really into the Riot Girl movement in mm-hmm. the early '90s. So yeah. Kathleen Hanna and a lot of the Riot Girl bands were a big inspiration. In fact, that's how I started playing drums. Oh, cool! Uh, originally, I was a drummer in a band, um, in a few bands, and uh, was you know punk bands yeah you know <laughs> so uh so yeah it's just looking back to that that early um inspiration and, and kind of thinking about those issues and how they apply to me now what's changed what hasn't it's kind of a personal take on on feminism and women's roles mm-hmm. yeah. uh, have, did you watch that documentary on kathleen hannah have you seen i that did yet? yeah it is so good yeah it was i was great. like man she is amazing She's even more amazing than I already thought she was. There because there was a lot of that I didn't know. Yeah, and she's yeah. just fantastic. It was really cool. It was very revealing and interesting. Yeah, yeah, really, really a good, good movie. Absolutely. So the new album is called Cosmic Logic. Highly recommend people going out and uh, seeing Peaking Lights tonight. They're going to be playing Barboza, and then for all of our Port- Portland listeners, they will be in your city tomorrow, and then on to San Francisco. And uh, one more question before we get back to another song: What is your ties to Wisconsin? What is in Wisconsin that <laughs> made you guys go back there a couple times. The winter. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> That's a huge draw. That's why Aaron wanted to go. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, it was part of the reason, because I mm. left from Southern California, so I'd never experienced that before. Snow and ice and yeah, the yeah. whole thing, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's I, it's, it's all me. I was, I was born there. I was raised there. Mm-hmm. So uh, I moved to San Francisco in the late 90s, and uh, after living in San Francisco for about 11 years, Aaron and I uh, had met and we wanted to live somewhere that was cheap where we could rent like a whole house and live out in the country. And I knew from growing up there that that was was very possible and there's beautiful land there. So we went and we did that. We lived out in the country and that's where Peking Lights was born, actually. Cool. Yeah. Um, but after um, maybe six months, <laughs> You're like, we need some city. <laughs> in the winter. Is that when you we went to Madison? Like, did you go to Madison then for a little bit? We did go yeah. to Madison. We were, we, were we were in the country for two years. Yeah. Wow. Before. But we we were in the country for two years, and mm-hmm. then we went to Madison because uh, partially because of jobs. We wa- we needed to 
to figure out a way to earn money while we also did music. And so right. we actually opened a store, oh, cool. a vintage clothing and record store called Good Style Shop, which is still there, oh, cool. run by some friends now. Awesome. So that's, that's really awesome. And we had shows there. Uh, we brought bands through. Well, we Madison's had- kind of a cool cool little town is it not yeah yeah, yeah. I, i've never been there myself but there's I've another heard. madisonian right back there oh, yeah. yeah yeah wow. who, who moved out here yeah, yeah he had in fact yeah. we yeah. met him through our store <laughs> no good way. style shop and it's, an, yeah. it's awesome because he just moved out here so yeah. we get to say hi wow that's <laughs> wonderful that's so cool but now you guys are back in california yeah yeah we've been in la for three years but actually at least you got to do the the live in the country thing you did it you we know? did it and we know that we liked it right we just need to figure out how we can do music Full time living yeah. in the country in California. Yeah. Ex- there Where it's you go. Warm. That by would the be, beach. Country by be the beach. Perfect. Yeah, yeah. By the beach. All right, you guys well. are on your way. <laughs> and you've uh, you got to work with the Flaming Lips recently, or contribute to something that they did, right? We contributed to. Uh, that was a while ago. That was uh, last year. year. Yeah. Or something. About a year yeah, ago. Yeah, we yeah. We contributed to a Stone Roses comp that they did. That's so cool. Yeah, it was fun. Actually, I have to say because I I'm horrible at doing cover songs, so mm-hmm. Indra was like you know she she put it together and then i, I did all the it. weird yeah she <laughs> <Right>. transcribed it <laughs> but <laughs> i did and then i made it put all the weirded stuff on it right right yeah, yeah yeah it was fun it was it's a it was a good song it was fun to do it was a it was fun to also like uh get to know i mean we actually really uh, interacted with wayne coin but mm. um aaron got to hang out with him and go to a um miley cyrus concert yeah, I him <laughs> see miley cyrus, which was absolutely amazing <laughs> sounds uh, yeah. i bet it was <laughs> it was know? it was cool. like, no, I, you can't until you explain it until exactly. you see it you can't people would make fun of you that don't know but if they knew because it's a multimedia experience oh it's insane it's yeah. it's uh it's it's a crazy <laughs> artistic <laughs> mind f you yeah. know <laughs> <laughs> but, That's amazing. Yeah, it was re- it was really cool. It was cool. To, it was cool to see it. Yeah, now, and, going um, to a Miley Cyrus concert with Wayne Coyne. I mean, that alone is sounds like an acid <laughs> trip. Yes, and and he is one <laughs> unto himself. He's awesome. I've met him a few times. He's a great. Yeah, guy. Yeah, great, amazing, awesome. All right, peaking lights once again. Get the new album, Cosmic Logic. Go out to Barboza tonight. I love your guys' sound. I've, it's coincidentally a sound that I've uh, recently just been getting really into. Sort of minimal electro '80s kind of nighttime music. And uh, I've been getting into stuff like Gina X and things from the 80s and late 70s and 80s. And uh, to hear this right now is awesome for, for me and, uh, and a lot of listeners, I'm sure. So, Thank you. Absolutely. Yeah, thanks. So if you guys uh, would be so kind, we'd love to hear another song. Sure. Okay. All right. It's Peaking Lights here live on 90.3 KEXP. All right.
That is music from Peaking Lights here on KEXP Seattle. Thank you guys so much for uh, stopping by and doing this uh, for us Thank you. Thank you. That was uh, so cool. Wow, that was pretty awesome. Uh, So uh, the album is called Cosmic Logic. Uh, Get it. Go out to Barboza tonight. Check out Peaking Lights and uh, just wonderful music, wonderful sounds that you guys are creating together. I think it's a beautiful thing. Thanks very much. And I also, before we go, I made one observation. I don't know if anyone else has pointed this out to you before, but Aaron, if you take the first and last, uh, your first name and last name, the initials and your initials, it spells acid. That is cool. Was yeah. that meant to? Was that uh, <laughs> no, intentional? No, I, I do have it. So we right, realized that when we first started dating. Stand. Yeah. And Aaron tattooed it on his arm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. That's so. Yeah. That's so cool. I was looking down at your names and I was like, Hey, wait a second. Are those <laughs> that's there? Cool that you saw, that's cool that you saw it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's cool that you saw that. Yeah, I saw it just right there, and I was like, Wait, is this? Uh, is these your real names? But they are. So I think, <laughs> I think that's pretty cool. Cosmic, man. It's cosmic. It was meant to be. (laughs) Awesome. Well, thanks again, you guys, for stopping by. Thank you for having us. Absolutely. That was Peaking Lights live here on 90.3 KEXP Seattle. Discover new music at listenerpoweredkexp.org.